What's up everybody? So today's gonna feel a little bit of like a deja vu because I bought another MacBook Pro. Uh, this one is the M1 Max and if everything is specced out as they claimed, I saved over $700 on this MacBook. Without further ado, let's go ahead and get this open and see if it's right, see the quality, see everything about this thing. Is it complete trash? Because I bought this on eBay, so it could be anything. Oh wow, so no box. So, so in the description it said it would have the box with it. So not off to a good start. All right. But we do have the actual charger that comes with it. They beat Amazon on that. This is only the 61 watt brick. This is the brick you would normally get with it. This is 140 watts. So if you buy it from Apple, you get this. On at least this unit, you get only a 61 watt charger. So in the description, it said that it was used, previously owned, whatever they called it. And it said it could have scratches on the body and on the screen. Now, I don't care if there's scratches on the body, but if there's scratches on the screen, I'm gonna be like, oh, what did I just do? So let's go ahead and find out. Overall, it looks really good from here. It is space gray. I like silver better. But I couldn't pass up the savings. Okay. All right, so if you look, oh, that just rubs right off, man. The issue with space gray is that it does show scratches more, but so far I'm not seeing much. This looks really good. There's like a little nick right here, but other than that, let's open it up. The screen looks good. This thing looks new. Like this thing looks really, really good. Now they did send me the serial number ahead of time and I looked and it was purchased in November 1st or 2nd. I'm gonna go through a migration assistant process to get everything transferred because a lot of times I would recommend just starting off fresh. It frees up a bunch of space. But since the computer that I had last was only like a month old or less than a month, there's no reason not to use the migration assistant. All right, so I have it all set up and it is exactly what they said it was gonna be. It is the M1 Max, 32 gigs of RAM. This is the 10 core CPU, 32 core GPU. Oh man, one terabyte hard drive in there. I mean, this thing, I cannot wait to edit this video on it, edit other videos, code on it, do everything that I do every day on this device for years to come because this thing is going to last me a very, very long time. Oh, also the battery cycle is at 22 already. I wish that was a little lower. When I bought the one from Amazon, it was only at like four to six and it was about the same age as this one. I bought it off eBay. I saved over $700 on this computer. That's including tax and everything. Like $700, more than seven. It was like 750 almost, maybe even more than that. So the 22 cycles I can definitely live with. I didn't see hardly any other than just one little ding on the outer case. Screen looks absolutely amazing. The only thing that I'm like, ah, it's space gray. I'm not the biggest fan of space gray. I'm in the camp to where if Apple just kind of weans off the space gray, I'm totally fine with that. I would prefer silver, but when you're saving over $700, well worth the, the price. This device is completely amazing. If you haven't seen my other video on me unboxing the one from Amazon, where I saved 300 on that one, it's right here. And I hope you guys have a great rest of your day. I will see you all in the next one. God bless.